You know my next guest from playing Aladdin on the big screen and from season one of Brave's Evolving Vegan. Now he's spreading his wings in the upcoming Canadian movie, The Butterfly Tale. Please welcome my bud, Mina Masood. <laughs> Good, I'm good. First congratulations up. on your show. Dude, congratulations yeah. to you. Yeah, thank you, thank you. You always bring such excellent, excellent fashion anytime <laughs> I've seen you. It's like wild. Thank you. Yeah. Well, you're wearing your uh, butterfly uh, jumpsuit. I what did. is it? Uh, it's an nice. overall. I appreciate the overall, jumpsuit really grows overall. it up a bit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Well, I am so excited about this movie for you. Thank you. Thank the you. Butterfly Tale, animated movie. You play Patrick. Yeah. Yes. So tell me more about that. Yes, it's a coming of age story, mm -hmm. animated film. Uh, it's Canadian. We've got some incredible Canadian talent in it. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah, Tatiana Maslany. Tatiana Maslany's yeah. in it. We've got music by Sean Mendez. No way. So, yeah. yeah, we've got some great Canadian talent in it, and uh, it's always nice coming back home and, and doing a film. So, yeah. Totally. That's yeah. amazing. When did you actually work on this? Uh, last year. Mm -hmm. uh, voice, voice acting is the best because yeah. you go into a studio wherever you are, mm -hmm. and you're wearing like sweatpants. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't matter what you look like. Yeah. So it was great. Yeah, got to just go in there and and be very theatrical with yeah. it because you know we're doing an animated film. Yeah. So is there a difference when you're preparing for a voiceover role, other than just wearing sweatpants, um, <laughs> versus like a role where you're going to be on screen? Yeah, it's it's prep in a different way. Yeah. You're, you're still preparing the same way when it comes to script work mm -hmm. and character work, but obviously, you know, I don't have to do my hair. Yeah. I don't have to, <laughs> you just go in there looking like whatever. And, I call that uh, goblin mode. Goblin mode. Yeah, that's my I favorite like mode it. to be in. Me too. Yeah. Me too. So yeah, in that way, it's it's a little different, and yeah. you get to be very big and theatrical because you have to tell the story using only your voice, yeah. which is uh, it's different. Totally. Now, in this story, you're Patrick, and, and you have something, you, you want to be able to fly like all the other butterflies, yes. but you can't because you're missing a wing? Yeah, he, Patrick has a full wing and yeah. an underdeveloped yeah. wing, and so he can't fly. Mm -hmm. And um, obviously, every year, monarch butterflies actually go on this three to 5,000 kilometer journey. Yeah. They migrate from Canada and the United States all the way to central Mexico. Yeah. And so he's got to do this, but he can't, he can't fly and his mom and his community wants him to stay back. Yeah. Uh, so he sneaks his way in nice. and he's, he's going on, on this journey. So it's a coming of age story. Mm -hmm. It's a story about identity and overcoming challenges. Yeah. Uh, something that, you know, we, we all go through. So we've, we've met before. You were on my podcast, yes. Mary's Reservation for Two. Yes. We ate at the best Mexican restaurant, La Bertola. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, if you need a restaurant recommendation, this is your man, let me tell you. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. I got you, I got you. Now, and we really got into it, we talked about a lot of stuff, um, but what I didn't tell you is my biggest fear in life is butterflies. Really? Yes. <laughs> Oh man, why I, is that? I don't, you know what it is? They don't have straight lines. They live real fluttery and I right. don't trust it. A right. spider, I'm like, oh, you're spooky and you're going this way. Right, Butterflies? Right. Yeah, you don't know where they're going. You don't know where they're going. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Well, I, go watch Butterfly Tale. I help, feel like it's gonna you. help. I wore my butterflies yeah. for you. Yeah. I, help you overcome that fear. I feel it. But have you ever had a role where you were kind of, something was scary about it for you that you kind of had to overcome to actually do it? Yeah, I well, I have a film coming out um, this December <laughs> on Shudder. It's a horror film. It's called Sacrifice Game. Oh, geez. And uh, I, I <laughs> had to I had to play a villain. And no. uh, yeah, yeah. And so that was that was kind of out, out of my comfort zone because yeah. I usually play the good guy. Yeah. But uh, yeah. <laughs> it was really fun. I got to explore a different side of me and uh, tap into you know the villainous side. Yeah. And so th that'll be a great film that's coming out as well this, that's this December. And you just announced, you're a busy man. Yeah. You just announced that you're working on a podcast, a new yes. podcast called yes. Growth Untold. Yes, yes. So tell us a bit about that. Yeah, so Growth Untold, um, I teamed up with one of my childhood best friends. Mm -hmm. uh, we grew up together. I've known him since we were six, seven years old. Yeah. And um, we really want to inspire and motivate people by bringing guests on that you may have never heard of before mm -hmm. that are incredibly successful. Um, so, you know, we've got on like the president of the Hudson's Bay Company. Oh, wow, okay. We've got on the chief brand officer of Gymshark. Uh, we're going to have the president on of the Milwaukee Bucks. So, like, Whoa. really cool people yeah. that 
y you don't always hear about. They're a little more behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah. maybe, maybe, or yeah. you know, and just talk about their journey. Yeah. And it's really focusing on less about their jobs yeah. and their day to day, and more about you know, how did they get to the position that they're in? Mm -hmm. You know, what did they have to do? Their upbringing, their life journey, and uh, just want to inspire people to chase their dreams, really. That's amazing, and you've 100% yeah. done that. It's amazing, and Thank you. you, one of your dreams and one of the things you're super passionate about is vegan diets. Yeah. So you have Evolving Vegan, which is a blog, a cookbook, uh, basically a community, and yeah. also a Crave series. Yes. Which just announced you have a season two. Yes, yes. No big Thank deal. Thank you. And you're Thank filming you. right now, right? Yeah, we are. We're in, uh, we're in season two now. Mm -hmm. I just got back from Montreal, so we're doing Montreal, Philadelphia, Miami, mm -hmm. Las Vegas, New Orleans, and Tokyo. No! Yeah. Oh my gosh. Hey, Mary here. What did you think? Drop your comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more of the good stuff.